Hello, Forge of Empire fans. Hello to my guildmates. Something strange with the euphoria numbers. I'm trying to uh, follow up on this phenomena. So, my city should be ready for harvest in about 12 or so minutes. Uh, about nine and a half hours ago, my euphoria and my productivity were lower. Nothing's changed, but somehow now my productivity is back up to 150 percent and additional euphoria is at 150. So the demanded for the demand for euphoria is 1050, which doesn't make sense because I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I have eleven, maybe twelve aqueducts, and each one requires two hundred and twenty-five. So how can my demand for euphoria be so low? So something is really wrong with the numbers, and I cannot understand it. So uh, I haven't really looked into it, but I'm beginning to look into it now. It just doesn't make sense. And of course you cannot, I don't know, I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven triumphal arches, okay? Each one provides uh, 675. So, my seven triumphal arches, if each one provides 675, okay? 7 times 7 is 49, all right? But here, it says provided euphoria is 2250. How is that possible? And demand for euphoria is 150. Uh, is a thousand and fifty. Okay, so twenty two fifty minus one thousand and fifty should be two hundred, but they say I have additional euphoria of two hundred. So the numbers just don't add up. I don't know why, I don't know how. I think this. Uh, function of the software is really weird. But, uh, okay, this is uh, Eno, a company that puts out uh, shady software or quality, inferior quality software that has bugs left and right. And when I expose the bugs that they have, they refuse to admit it. And if you don't believe me, I'll show you what I mean. These are my quests. So this is a special quest. It tells me, okay, to scout the province east of Ravens Creek and scout the province southeast of Ravens Creek. Now, Ravens Creek is a Ravens Creek is a province in LMA which is here, okay? Now, if you notice, every province has an icon representing that, I, that province. 
This one, you click on it, it tells you Ravens Creek. Okay, now, the provinces... Oh, and by the way, it's a bonus province, okay? And then there are provinces to the left of it. I'm sorry, to the right of it here. So that's east and then it's south, which I have already scouted and actually acquired. But they don't have the icons. Normally, if you don't, if you haven't, scouted a province, you can't see it because it's covered by clouds. But you see all the provinces here because it's complete. Yeah, I'll show you what I mean. So, this particular quest is occupying a recurring quest line. It has been doing so since LMA. So I decided, okay, if I go to Colonial, Maybe it will clear things up and the software will adjust itself and clean itself up. Didn't do it. I logged out. Uninstalled the software. Reinstalled the software. Didn't do it. Something is wrong. Something is not kosher, as we say in the Jewish world. So let's do this again. See here? All these clouds. Oh well, you cannot see the the provinces because of the clouds. Although here it does show you some provinces here, which I haven't had a chance to yet. Okay. Okay. What is this? Uh, all right, I'll come back to this later. So, I have a ticket about it, and according to support, I asked them to check the logs. They said they did, and they said I haven't scouted it. And I already have, and I acquired it, because I did it before February 29th, in which the new system which was supposedly an advanced system to let you uh, move up through the early ages faster, uh, was installed, but on February 29th, they decided to go to the old system, so they discontinued that, and they redid something. And since I actually acquired those provinces before those, that date, I think there's a problem here, but they refuse to see it. They don't give me the opportunity like I have here. See, here I have opportunity to scout, which I just did here. But in that particular world, it cannot be done. Oh well, what can I say? I have previous videos that show you that I have scouted those particular provinces and maybe I should play them again, but it is what it is. Different battles to fight, anyway. So here, my attack bonus is 160%, my opponent's bonus 60%. In a few minutes, one of my aqueducts still cooking will become active, so that will be 110, and I will add two more, so that will be 130% difference between my boost and the systems boost. So let's go back and see if it's ready. All right, here's the one that's cooking. And I have to wait f five minutes. 
Okay, the question is, where will I put the next two? Because I have 32,000 uh, coins and 36,000 supplies. I'll be adding approximately 200,000 coins. A little less than 200,000 supplies because I uh, forgave one of my tailors. So I only have seven instead of eight tailors. So I'm not producing uh, 38,000. Oh, I hope I'll have enough for the two. I might not have it, but we'll see. Well, I will have it because the town hall should give me... Oh, wait a minute. How can the town hall be in 10 hours from now? 10 hours ago, it didn't give me anything. Ah, something's wrong here. Many things are wrong here. Town hall. So I might not have two hundred thousand supplies. Huh. Oh well. I've added some extra roof tile house because I wasn't getting as many uh coins as I thought I should and that kind of changed things around but it did give me the coins so now instead of having an abundance of supplies I had a, an abundance of 200,000 supplies a few days ago but because I'm not getting the full amount I'm not getting the 200,000 hmm. well, let's see what happens in a few minutes. Well, I think we could do one fight while we're waiting. Oh, uh, this is not a good fight. You cannot win this fight with eight ballistas. Especially, I mean, the only way you can win this fight with eight ballistas if the ballistas can knock out these horses in two hits which they should be able to do because they got a 100% greater military boost. But, you know, rig the game. So the only way to win is with four, ballist four ballistas and four archers, at which point you don't get the double because you're not using the preferred units. So, I mean... They post mathematical numbers, and math has values. It doesn't matter what the conditions are, what your opinion is, what the temperature is. 2 plus 2 equals 4 in any language, in any circumstances, okay? So when I have a ballista that supposedly has 10 attacks, I mean, 10 points and 8 for defense, okay? And it's attacking a horse that has, I'm sorry, my eyes are bad, 8 defense and 13 attack. So 10 plus 10 is 20. 20 is greater than 8. So 20 should eliminate 8 in 2 hits, right? And this one? 13. So 20 is greater than 13. But no, it doesn't happen that way. Some of these horses, 13, I need to hit them four times. That means 40. Are you kidding me? You know, you should be ashamed of yourself for rigging the game so absurdly. All right. Well, let's go back and see how the numbers will change when I get one, two, or three additional aqueducts. Okay, so, again, I always check my production. Productivity is 150%. So, 93.75. So is correct. 18750 is double that is correct. And 
37500 is double the 18 so basically the uh, roof tile house provides you the minimum amount of coins whereas the cottage gives you double the roof tile house and the villa gives you double the cottage the same true is true with supplies the uh, tailors give you 18 750 and the uh, goat farm gives you double that no, it gives you more than double that, sorry. Ah, I didn't notice that until now. But the butcher gives you half of that. Okay, I didn't notice, but the goat will give you 65,000. Okay. So, yeah, I do have the 200 plus thousand supplies okay so I'm going to delete one of my uh, red roof tiles because I don't really need it but again look look at the numbers oh the numbers have changed ah because I added uh, another uh, triumphal arch okay so I need to delete this particular red roof tile. Because I need space to place no, two additional. Okay. So now I'm going to put two more and I'm going to finish in and they're fully cooked. So just added 30% uh, percent boost to my units. Let's see what that did to my... Okay, well at least the numbers stayed the same. Ah, oh, we'll have to do the numbers a little later on. Okay, let's see what we have now in terms of power. Okay, so now so now instead of 10 I have 12 and instead of 8 I have 9 so I went from 4 and 3 to three times as much by increasing my military boost to 190 percent. I still don't think I can win with eight ballistas against four, so I'm just going to be conservative. I have no choice. I cannot fight any other battles until I win this one. So let's see what my winnings are here. So I have to be careful to see where these guys are. One, two, three, four, five. They can reach this guy. Okay, so I could take this horse with this particular Archer. 
at least half of him. Now hopefully the remainder is enough for the ballista to finish him off. Okay, so here's the problem. One. Can these guys? No, they cannot reach. So he can reach, but he cannot. One, two, three, four. All right, so he can reach my archer, but these two, so I might get wounded on this one particular archer. Okay, and see, I got wounded. Four ballistas. Have to take the four horses with one hit. Okay. Okay. Finally, this would not have happened. Had I not added the 30% military boost. Okay, so two of my Archers got wounded, but I'll take that. At least they were not eliminated. Normally I lose one, sometimes two. And of course I only get, I don't get the double points. Okay. Let's try again. Let's see if I can get this time with eight ballistas. The trick is not to allow the arches to reach the ballistas. Okay, can the archers reach me? Can reach that one particular ballista. This one cannot, and this one cannot. So just one ballista needs to be moved. Now the question is, can these ballistas take out three horses? Okay, so... This horse can be taken out in two hits without a problem. So let's do that. Okay. Now what about these? If I can get these two horses out with three hits, I'll be happy. Because the, the, the archers cannot hit me. Except for one right now that I have to move out of the way. One hit. Wow it, looks, wow, it looks like finally the boost works. And now I can take out the archer. And now it's auto battle. 
Okay, so my boost is finally working. Next thing is we'll see if when I fight against four horses and three archers, can my eight ballistas take out the four horses? Not sure yet, but we'll see. Maybe yes. In which case I'll get the double points. Test it out next time it happens. So now this should be okay. I'm checking to see if any of my terrain gives me hills where I can use the hills uh, to increase my power. All right, so I think I need to do here. Let's see where is that guy? He's the last one, so I don't have to worry about him. Okay. I can't tell if this one particular terrain is a hill or not because the way Eno sets up the visual effects for old people it makes it very difficult and I cannot hover because I'm using a smartphone and they hover uh, features not available Well, I cannot put him there now if I want to take him out. So he still cannot hit. Oh. Alright, let's see if... See? cannot. Okay, able to take care of that one. Let's see if I can take care of this one. Okay, I got it. See, I cannot. Ridiculous that I cannot take out a horse in two hits. It is absolutely ridiculous. But now I get, okay, we'll try that next time. And it's a hit. All right. So these guys now have to move out of the way. But I think I can take care of these guys with three hits, especially if I get the two. One of our ballistas got hit by a, from a wounded ballista, so the hit is not that significant, but still need to take him out of action, but I have enough ballistas to cover him. Okay. All 
Okay, this should be an easy battle because we only have one horse. Always check. Okay, we've got one here. All right. Get the horse ready. To the ballistas. That's the last one, so this one is gonna come in earlier. Cannot reach any terrain with hills. How about this one? No, he cannot. So let's just go and take out this guy. And then we basically have a horse. Well, see this particular node, which I cannot reach right now, to the northeast of my current ballista, is hills and will give me the boost. All right. Uh, we'll use it for this guy. And now uh, everybody go on this one. And it's over. So we figured out how to fight those guys. Okay. I need to rest before I tackle this one on with my four arches and four ballistas. That's it for now, folks.